Okay, so to get rid of these fractions, you're going to have a, to find a common denominator. And on the 4x term, even though they don't have a denominator written, you need to consider the denominator to be a 1 under there. So you need to find a number that 1, 4, and 5 all go into evenly. Um, if you want, one way you can do that is to just list the multiples. Multiples of 5 are 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, and so on. Multiples of 4 are 4, 8, 12, 16, 20. So notice they have the 20 in common. That would be your least common multiple. So then what you're going to do is you're going to go to each side of the equation and you're going to multiply each side of the equation by 20. So make sure when you do that to distribute. So you're going to have to take 20 times x divided by 5. You're going to have to take 20 times 4x divided by 1. And then you're going to have to take 20 times 1 divided by 4. Okay, well 20 times x is 20x. 20x divided by 5 is 4x. 20 times 4x is 80x. 80x divided by 1 is 80x. 20 times 1 is 20, and 20 divided by 4 is 5. So then you can combine your like terms. 80 plus 4 is 84x. <clears throat> Divide each side by 84, and x is 5 over 84.